Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Zach Waters, and welcome back to some South Park The Fetching Bat Hole, episode 4, I believe. When we left off, we just came into the police department, and we basically found a few things here and there. Um, last episode, we did lots of exploring, and not so much to do with missions, but at the moment, as you can see right here, we've got to... Actually, we'll go into map. We've found five, I believe, of the paintings or images for Craig's dad. We've also been asked to distribute Mr. Adams' headshot uh, for a reward or whatever is in his bottom drawer. Master all raisins, um, basically. I don't even know what that means, to be honest. And then once again, when it comes to night time, we have to go over and find out who's been king Randy's car. On top of all that, we've got to meet Father Maxi at the church and then go to the school and talk to the teacher. As for our mission items, um, right here, we have found Clyde's garage key, so now we can open up the, gar the garage. Um, we have Mr. Adams' headshots, and then we found Karen's doll, who apparently belongs to Kenny's sister. One thing I'm very excited for is... <laughs> but we're gonna go ahead and grab ourselves a $30 phone plan. But first, what we, we have, have to talk here? to the police. Looks like we've got another little junior crime fighter, boys. Is that it, kid? Well, the police can always use the help of concerned citizens. I guess we can give our little junior detective a special kitty case to work on. That would be great. There's somebody new to town, shaking up the crime families. This is a real bad dude. A kingpin of crime who wants to control all the drugs in the city. We've tracked him to this location here. I need you to go in and neutralize him. You lead point, my boys will be there after. Oh if you god. Take out the drug kingpin will give you this junior detective badge. Pretty neat, huh? Now get out there! So yes, sir! Alright, so basically that's just, that's what we got to do. Someone is on the loose, someone is not doing a good thing, and they have to pay. Hey, I bet you can find a spot for my headshot in the police station. After all, I'm wanted for... Alright, so... Maybe here? Um... Oh, here we go. So we've got to do eight of them. So I'm pretty sure we'll see his, his head floating around. We didn't actually gain that many followers on Instagram. Oh, Instagram, sorry. Last episode, we got a bunch of old people. That's kind of it, I think. Well, Alright, where's Jesus? Child. I haven't seen you before, but you come at a crucial time. South Park is sliding into moral decline. Someone's stealing our cats. They're TPing houses. Okay, maybe it's not full on Armageddon yet, but we do need a hero. Not to make the hard sell, but do you see yourself as a good person? Well, I can understand the confusion. But there comes a time when we need to choose our path. Will you find Jesus and take the righteous path? Or maybe you'll walk the middle way. Let's not talk about the third alternative. I'm hoping you're part of the solution, not the problem. All right, man. Take the first step, my child, by entering this meditative chamber, which will allow you to confront your deepest fears. Face your fears, new child. Face your fears. You're my fear at the moment, man. Oh God, your it's all dark. Your mom. You afraid of the dark? Snakes? The color blue? Ooh. Oh, fuck off. <laughs> oh hey, I'm in your imagination. Just a friendly Catholic priest who would like to get to know you a little better. Yeah, that's right. I'm totally in your imagination too. About to give you a shoulder rub. Ever imagine you'd feel something like this? Let me adjust the lighting Jesus. in here a bit so we can get some visuals with that. Yep, yeah, I thought we were going to have to kill him. These enemies use telegraphic attacks indicated by the red striped squares on the combat grid. That's essentially what we have to do. What's that? 2738. Fine, fuck this guy. Huh? Oh my. I don't understand how we can get out of that. God's children are deserving of his love. What the fuck? Jesus Christ! Bless you, child, for I have sinned. Yeah, so basically, we're we're fucked. He's fucked us, dude. What the fuck are you doing, man? Uh, we'll get rid of this guy first. Oh, I guess you want to do it the hard way. <laughs> I do not. I don't, to be honest. Open yourself to God's love. Restores a minimum amount of health. Restores minimum amount of health. Negative status, that would be good. 
<clears throat> and we got a bunch of health, so hopefully that gets rid of the charm thingy he put on us. Alright, it's time this cunt gets a fucking hit. Ah, oh, I like that. God, it's so fucking gross. They have condoms on the floor. Oh, I can't do anything. I've got to stand there and it's- Oh, he can, he can die. That just means this guy can, yeah, do whatever he wants to me. No. We'll take you to Pound Town, my boy. Wonderful. Level 3, we have ranked up. We got a minor slot. New artifact slot unlocked. Well, gosh, I feel just awful about all that. Tell you what, a rabbi friend gave me this macaroni picture. In times of trouble <laughs> and tribulation, use it to call upon the prophet Moses. Good luck on your spiritual journey, my child. Thank you, my man. Just what I needed. You've received your first summon. During combat, access the items menu and use the macaroni picture to summon Moses. Awesome. We'll head back in. Oh, we can't. Oh, we've got another fucking code. Of course. I'll be in touch soon when you're ready to take the next step. Um, I'm sure this all is the same. Oh, we can actually go in here. So, yeah, I want to go into that room again just because I saw a painting. Uh, hopefully there's a a code in here. <laughs> Kneel before Jesus. Kneel before Jesus, alright. Kneel before Jesus. Kneel before Jesus. Get me inside there, bitch. Yeah, so we found the first five. We got uh, some money from Craig's dad. I would be proud to have a photo of us together after all we've been through. Look at that, I'm scared as shit. Hey, butthole, you're doing great. Really quality character sheet stuff happening here. I've got a super secret mission for you. Head over to the new taco shop on Main Street and buy me a taco. Kin out. <laughs> Alright, so whereabouts is that? We're on the other side. So we've got to go all the way over there anyway. So I think on the way, we're going to do what I'm for some reason so excited for. You guys know what I'm talking about. We're going to go back and grab ourselves the $30 phone plan. All right, there we go. There's another headshot. I see you flapping around in there. All right, D-Mobile. Here we are. You don't look happy with your current cell plan, kid. I don't have one. That's why I'm going to buy one. I am going to buy myself a $30 D-Mobile phone plan. I'll put you on <laughs> list. Oh god, what did I just do? Come back anytime. Look at you with all that storage on your device. Yeah, all that storage, man. Thanks so much. I'm just not sure exactly what it does. Holy shit, I'm Blake from from Workaholics. Let's change ourselves up. Sure. Uh, we will obviously have to have the heat glaive ones. As for the eyewear, nah, sticking with those. Wonderful. So there we are. We've bought ourselves the freaking thing. Oops. Hello. Thank you. I see you. I'm taking that. Thank you very much. Uh, yep. Right man. Whatever you say. Oh, looks like we've got a clothes shop. What the fuck? You know you don't work here, right? You don't know me. What about is this going? Over here? Oh, so here's the taco place. We'll go right in. Welcome to Freeman's Tacos. If there's anything <laughs> I can interest you in, I knew it. I had a fucking instinct. I fucking thought about it too. Jesus Christ. Of course. I love this place because you can craft whatever food items you want. Is that right? How wonderful. Thank you. One to go after this. And another shit. There we go. Can I get a selfie with you? Maybe when you're better at crafting, I'll take a selfie with you. Better at crafting. Right, so we're going to do a bit more crafting for Morgan Freeman to like us. Um, actually I should have bought him a... Uh, bought him a taco. I'm 
Congratulations, new kid. Thank you, man. Enchilada and a burrito you've crafted an enchilada. That's the first time anyone's ever done that. And what the hell? Have a few more recipes. They might just save your stupid ass. Thank you. Thank you. So I can't have one yet. To do now, but document this moment in human history with a selfie. Fuck yes. Morgan Freeman. Who would have thought? And just one more thing. They say that some farts are so powerful they can actually bend the fabric of time. You be careful out there. Whatever you say, man. Alright, so we can go this way now. Fuck the lava. Drive along three. Aren't superheroes kind of played out? Fuck you! No, they're not. Alright, so obviously we can get up there somehow. Up to the ladder. We've got something over here. Alright, apparently I can't go through that. What do I do with these fucking things, man? Remember Passion of the Christ? Oh, I don't want to remember that. Remember when Sinbad played a genie in Shazam? Yeah, actually, no, I don't mean me. I mean me. <laughs> no, I don't mean me. Alright, uh. Hmm. Is there a doorway? No. I think we'll do the the police mission. And we're about to make on. Alright, so. Uh -oh. Looks like I'm there's a crossing here party. where we can go. That's a good He's point. coming this way. Come a little closer. Okay, you're approaching the hideout. Find a way in, but be careful. He's probably armed to the teeth. Nah, we've got the fucking advantage, cunt. Fast travel to Big Gay Al's house. We've got something there. What is that gonna do? Alright. <clears throat> Alright, where's this guy? You should have him in sight. Hey, who are you? What are you doing in my house? Engage! Engage! <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, so he is a drug dealer. Alright, this guy is gonna get it whacked in the head. What's wrong with me? Yes, man, I'm trying. I'm 47. Yeah, this guy's dead. Two hits. You weak little bitch. Ooh, a blade? I'll take a blade. For sure. Holy shit, you're the real deal, superhero. That's you bet. Less violent degenerate this town has to deal with. Please come by and help us again. Help you again? I mean, as a big thing, as a big fuck you to this guy. Obviously, I'm gonna have to take a dump in the in the toilet. Oh, okay, sure. Thank you. Even though I just ran into your room and asked for a selfie, no Thanks, worries. Kid. See you online. Okay, kid. I'll give you a pity follow. What the heck? A pity follow. Wonderful. Better than no follow. No worries, have a good one. Do not use the toilet for at least half an hour. I'm gonna stink that fucking thing out. Alright, here we go. Work it out. Oh Jesus. That is so fucked. But yes, you wanna leave that for half an hour to an hour. Um, it's gonna smell. Oh God. Alright guys, I'm gonna end the episode right here. Um, obviously, beginning of the next episode, we're gonna have to fight these guys. Yeah, thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. I'll see everyone in the next video. See you later.